Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This video is about migrating your WhatsApp from Android to iOS. Moving from Android to iOS and vice versa used to be a very hectic task in the past and which often meant that you have to sacrifice your data when you are moving from one platform to another. And especially was the case with the WhatsApp. You were not able to move your WhatsApp data from Android to iOS. There was no straightforward way except you use some third party tools and or you decide to sacrifice your data. But the things have recently changed. A couple of months ago, Meta, after a long wait, they announced the ability to transfer your WhatsApp account information, profile photo, individual chats, group chats, chat history, media and settings using move to iOS app on your Android from Android to iOS. So now you can easily transfer your WhatsApp data from Android to iOS. So before we start the process, there are some prerequisites that we need to understand here. First of all, your Android phone, it must have Android version 5 or above. Your Apple device must be running iOS version 15.5 or above. You should have Move to iOS application installed on your Android phone. You should also have the latest version of WhatsApp installed on your Android phone. So the WhatsApp version, the minimum WhatsApp version that you need is 2.22.7.74 or above. And you need to have the SIM that you can transfer from your old phone to the new phone in order to register your WhatsApp here. Apart from this, you need to also make sure that both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi. So let's start the process. The first thing we should do is to install Move to iOS application on your Android phone. You can simply find it in Google Play Store and install it. So in my case, I've already installed it. Then the next thing is start configuring your iPhone. Now there is a catch here. This process only works on fresh iPhones. By fresh, I mean your phone is not pre-configured. If your phone is pre-configured, you'll have to factory reset it and start it from the scratch. Uh, yes, I know this is painful. It's not easy to just wipe out your phone and reconfigure it from the scratch, but this is the only way. So in my case, it's pretty easy because I'm configuring new iPhone 14 Pro Max. So I am doing it from the scratch. Choosing the language, region. Set up manually. So here I have to make sure that both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi. Continue. I'll set up Face ID later. Okay, so here is a screen. This is where the main action happens. Uh, we have to choose the second last option, which is move data from Android. So here it's telling us to install Move to iOS app, which we already have installed and continue. Mm, okay. Continue. And you have to enter this code onto your Android device. Oh, 
okay so now you need to choose on your android what needs to go to your ios and look at the last option whatsapp so i'll choose whatsapp and this is a short wizard move chats to ios transfer your chat history blah 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 you will not be able to transfer later if you skip this step so i want to do it now so now it is preparing my whatsapp data to be migrated to ios it takes a while so i'll pause the video and i'll see you once it is done so once whatsapp finished preparing the data i simply pressed next and the actual transfer started now it's moving all the data from android to ios via the wi-fi so the transfer has been complete we are done click continue on ios and from this step onwards we do not need our android phone anymore so let's move it aside and simply continue configuring your iphone Sign into your Apple ID, agree to terms and conditions. So continue setting up your iPhone. And here you go. Your iPhone is all set up and your WhatsApp backup has already been transferred from Android to iPhone. Now you have to install WhatsApp from App Store and register your phone number. So once WhatsApp is installed, open the WhatsApp, agree to the terms and conditions, allow notifications, enter your mobile number here. So once you verify through the text message, this is the next screen that you get. Move chats from Android. So your WhatsApp on your iPhone has automatically detected that there is a backup of chats on your phone. Let's start. So it needs permissions to restore your chats. Start. Access your photos, allow access to all photos. And the chats are now being restored on your iPhone. Okay, the importing has been finished. Chat history moved to iPhone. Click next. J 
just had it automatically picked up my display picture. Now I'll just enter my display name once again. Okay, looks cool. WhatsApp would like to access your contacts. Yes, allow access to the contacts. And here you go. These are all my chats from my Android. It includes text messages, photos, videos, and it also includes the voice messages. Pretty neat. So that's it. This is how you transfer your data from Android to iOS. Thank you for watching. I hope this has been informative for you and this helps you moving from Android to iOS. Thank you for watching. Please do not forget to like and subscribe the channel. I'll see you again with the next video.